And hello, everybody, and welcome back to the stream. Or if it's your first time here, welcome, and uh, here we are. Hope you're having a fantastic Saturday, or whatever day it is for you right now. And so, yeah, yesterday, we started kindergarten, did three of uh, the missions. Uh, wasn't really expecting to get it to even do that. I, <laughs> I thought it would be a lot more hard, but, of course, that's just the beginning. Now, now things going to get really convoluted because we've started getting items. We have, like, three items now from uh, the first three missions that we have to figure out how to use to get other missions finished. And so it's going to become a bit more convoluted. But it's a, it's a funny game, fun time. I'm, I, I enjoyed it, and I hope you all are as well. So let's uh, try and uh, get back into it real quick here. Oh, boy. Okay. Time, uh, time to go join the Nug Club. Oof. I'm not going to lie. I've completely forgotten everything about what the plan was going to be. <laughs> okay, I literally just don't remember already. Is it? Yes, it is. All right. Cool. Monday number four. Empty-headed me- Yep. I have a goldfish memory. Awesome. Cool. We have the key mold, we got these cards. Right. Be able to get it made for me for a price. I don't know if we need to do this now or like at the end, like when we have all the clues to get all the other things. Um, Monty Bugs, Lillian Nugget. Right, right, right. I don't need, a, I don't need any Jerome hints. Four of these. You go to the restroom without cigarettes during lunch. The hall monitor will take you to the principal's office. If you run out of time in the janitor's closet, he will appear and kill him. <laughs> yeah, I, th I think we're probably going to do Monty. You need a special item from Jerome as and as much money as you possibly can. Okay. Are you going to do the Monster Mon ending after the game routes? Uh, yeah, I think so. Like, it, it's... I, it, I think it, it might be partially story relevant, but also, but more importantly, I think it's just kind of easy. Like, it, it'll probably be really easy to do. Once you have all the hints in the game for all the missions, like, it's not really a big deal to go get the other cards, right? But okay, yeah, so we'll do Monty. All right. We need, we need this thing, and we need, uh... And I might as well get these. Wait, does the does getting this? No, that does not take a heart, to an apple. Okay, let's go. Yep. What happens if I do this? No. Don't lie to me. I know when I smell money. Fine. Okay. I imagine K two is gonna have a dedicated Monster Mon versus stream. Well, yeah. He's got, got to do all, got to do it, got to do all that, you know? So. No, 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 no. So we just, uh, I guess we just talked to Monty, like, immediately, I guess. Whoops, there we go. I'm Monty, if you need something, talk to me. I need a key made. That's the mold you want to use? Sure, no problem. It's gonna cost you $20. I'll have it made by the end of the day. You can pay me for it then. How am I gonna get that kind of money? I'm sure there's a ton of ways to do it. I'm still open to selling stuff to you. Try and gather some rare items. It's definitely possible. Oh, God. Can't wait for me to lose its <laughs> dumpster witch. Uh, the strongest possible thing. So we have to sell. I assume we have to sell Monty a bunch of shit. Uh, Three dollars. Oh god, deal. Wait, 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 wait. I can't sell the stupid flower. Your Monty Hacks and Tito's occasionally around Australia. Yeah, like, my brain doesn't really know what it's doing. 
Like, I don't... I literally just do not know what it is attempting to do. Also, I have no idea what to do now. Uh, getting items, huh? Supposed to get it throughout the day. Okay. Well, I don't know how to get any more items out here, so we're just gonna... We're just gonna do this. Pick your best buddies. All right. Can we talk to Monty again? What, you want to be my morning buddy? I ain't got time for that nonsense. So unless you're buying or selling some, get lost. Yeah, I don't know what I... So I'm supposed to get the money throughout the day. There's no way... Like, the apple is like, what, 25 cents? So there's no way that the apple is going to be... There's no way the apple is going to be enough. Finally feel well enough to not fall asleep and I'm late. Yeah, you're barely late, really. So I'm supposed to get the money. Get the money. Whatever, Cindy. Didn't you play this already? What are you talking about, Lazy? I've, ne I've never played this game on stream. <laughs> what do you mean? get $20 somehow. Hmm. Maybe I could get gold stars, actually. You know, now that I think about it, maybe I get gold stars. Uh, you know what? Let's, um... Hold on a moment. Let's go... I want to go get a gold star from the teacher and then see if I can sell the gold star. Because if we could sell the gold stars from the teacher, then that would definitely... Oh, whoops. Then that would definitely be, like, quite a lot of uh, money, right? Oh, assumedly. Sell the pills from Nugget to Monty. This has been Markiplier. Remember this game? Or Jacksepticeye. Me and Tara have watched him play this game several times. And I still don't remember the, the puzzle solutions. So Nugget has pills. Okay, let's try and get... Well, first of all, we'll... Uh, We'll do this. Sell the lunch pass. What? No? What are you knowing now? Billy is missing. Ah, okay, yeah, that's what I was thinking right now, yeah. I go, I'm talking about this. Billy is missing. Poor Nugget misses Billy. But Nugget cannot help him now, it is too late. You know where he is? Nugget does not know. Nugget knows who knows. Who knows? Her question's upset, poor Nugget. You push too hard. Nugget needs his pills. <laughs> Much better. What were, what were we talking about? Billy. Who? I don't know who you're talking about. What's in those pills? I don't know, the principal gave them to me after I saw something traumatic or something. They're great. The principal gave you pills? Yep. Is that legal? Probably not. You don't find that suspicious? I do, but he said that's a side effect of the pills. Of course. You want one? Sure. There you go. Enjoy that pill. Take it from talking about Billy too much. No more now. Shoo. Wish the principal would give me pills. <laughs> nuggets pills. Is that one of Nuggets pills? I got a guy who loves these. I'll give you one dollar for it. Buy a yo-yo. Oh god, I'm already... Okay, alright. What? 
Oh, I have no apples. Hmm. How do I get the pill from Nugget, though? And then also... What? Don't sell the lunch pass. Okay. Right, that makes sense. So let's get the... Uh, right, the yo-yo. Oh, now we're going to go... <laughs> what did you and this little weirdo do? Well, get going then. The principal is an impatient man. So, I've been told you're feeling sad about Billy. I guess I have. That's all this is about, right? Billy's missing and it makes you sad. You're not trying to find him or anything. You're just sad he's gone. Right. Okay, that makes this a whole lot easier. Here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna give you something. I want you to take it whenever you're feeling sad about Billy. What is it? There's a little something I ordered for this exact reason. Here, take one whenever you miss Billy too much, okay? Giving me pills? Just don't tell anyone you got them from me. The hall monitor is waiting to take you back to class. Please head outside. Okay. Ignore the... Yeah, I think he would shoot me if I didn't ignore it. Welcome back. I hope everything turned out okay with the principal. Everything is fine. Say, the principal didn't have, an, have given you anything, did he? No. What a shame. Okay, well, there's still some morning time left. Go ahead and play. Okay. During morning time, you can go ask the janitor about the body bags. And that gives you a free chocolate from the lunch lady that you will sell to Monty. Okay. Then that means I need to acquire... Um, that means I need to acquire, a bunch, like, uh, up to $9. Like, so, like, six more dollars. Yeah. Um... I don't know if I... Maybe I sell the pills to... Maybe maybe I have to sell the pills and the chocolate at lunch. Because, like, getting into the bathroom doing Jerome's thing is a lot of actions. So I think that's what we are gonna do. Uh, yeah, I can do that. Okay. Sweet. All right. So... This doesn't... It does take apples to walk in here. So we could ask the janitor about this shit, and he'll give us chocolate, huh? Hey, don't go messing around with those bags. Okay, sorry. Hey, what's going on there, boy? What's in those bags? What bags? I don't see no bags. Those bags. Oh, these bags. <laughs> Nothing for you to worry your stupid little head about. Now run along. Oh. Oh, I, okay. You're supposed. You are supposed to spe the sell the pills. Okay. Try that again.
Yep, yep, yep. Now, shut up, fat lady. Okay. So we do sell the pills. Bottle of pills. Whoa, we'll bottle those things? My guys who likes them is gonna be thrilled. I'll give you four dollars for the whole thing. Cool. Pleasure doing business. Okay. Okay, now we do Jerome's thing. Four dollars for pills, Monty is a scammer, yeah. Especially since we know where these came from. Okay. Oh, yes, uh, bleeding. Say, you know, I'm required to, uh, by law to say, stay at least one mop's length away from children at all times. How did that judgment get passed down? It's a long story, but it ends with someone on the end of a mop. Sounds riveting. It is, but that's a tale for another time. Yes, another time. Okay, how do I make him give me the chocolate, though, instead of murdering me? He's just gonna kill me, isn't he? I'm morbidly curious. <laughs> me too. That's what got me into this mess in the first place. Anyway, I don't think it would be appropriate for me to tell someone of your age that story. But it's okay for me to see a bloody bag in a bin? Righto, you sure are chipper, young sport. Here, take this nickel and buy yourself a bar of chocolate. A nickel won't cut it. What do you mean a nickel won't cut? A nickel gonna cut it if I'm gonna have to cut you. Chocolate is more expensive than a nickel. Oh. In that case, I'll let the old lunch lady know to give you a chocolate at a price you would have seen back in my day, before the whole mop incident. How about that? Okay, good. Now skedaddle. Go back to your class and back to class. Well, did you get it? What? Okay, kids, we all heard the lunch bell. Let's go down to the cafeteria. We'll talk at lunch. No, we won't. <laughs> hey, kid, over here. Did you get it? I couldn't get it. Aw, oh, man, that's a shame. Looks like I'm just gonna have to deal with whatever punishment I get from this. You can keep the pass. I'll see you around. Cool. Thanks. It's kind of funny. You know, it's kind of funny. Because if you fail his mission, but then go back to the class with, like, time left, he gets all pissed and he takes the pass from you. But here, he doesn't give a shit for some reason. Okay. Janitor said I could get it cheaper. Oh, you must be the janitor's new little friend. Yep. He said you were a good kid. I can let you have the chocolate bar for a nickel. Deal. You enjoy that then, kiddo. Have a nice day. She gives you money, money for putting gum in her hair, in Lily's hair. Hmm. The problem is that I see that I have only... The problem is that I only have four apples now. But I'm gonna sell him three things at once. I need... Well, okay, I guess two things at once. I... Can't stop sipping liquid, but okay. I don't know if I have enough actions, but... Wait, you said bonus points, actually. Oh, I fucked it up now, okay. It's fine. Well, I guess you said I'll give you a bonus. In which case, that must be the money, because we're not her boyfriend in this timeline.
Oh. That and recess put the gum in her hair? Okay. Chocolate. Hey, she managed to get that. It's almost worth its weight in gold. Excuse me. <clears throat> Buff chocolate. How'd you manage to get that? It's almost worth its weight in gold. Emphasis on almost. I'll give you five dollars for that. All right. A hall pass. Oh, snap. You got that from Jerome, didn't you? I'll give you five dollars for it. Deal. How's you doing business? Okay. Oh, do I sell the- oh, I sell the lunch pass now, too, don't I? Whoops. Wait, what? I can't sell the lunch pass anymore? Oh, that- that- that sucks. Okay. Just eat the apple? Okay. Okay, kiddos! That's the recess bell! Go burn off all that delicious slop you just ate! Go to recess. Yep. Sorry, Lily. I know he did it. I don't know why, but I know he did. Put gum in her hair. Are you freaking kidding me right now? Why did you do that? Just cuz. Leave me alone. I don't need this in my life right now. Get the Monster Mon card. Uh... <laughs> Oh! Cool. Now let's talk to Cindy. It was worth... Here's some money! It was worth every penny! Ha ha ha! Thanks. This was fun. We should do it again sometime. Yeah, maybe. Now I have $20. Okay. Want to buy something? No. See, now you can skip the apples. Wait, so I just do I just absorb all the apples and let the day end and then he gives it to me? Is that Oh, okay. All right. What did you bring? Cool. Money, 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 money. Okay, kids, it's the end of the day. You got the money? Yes. Wow, you raised all that in one day? I'm impressed. Thanks. You know, it's funny he's saying he's saying this shit of, oh, yeah, I'm impressed you raised all this money. And it's like, I got it from, like, selling stuff to you. So what do you mean? You kind of were, like, there. <laughs> what do you plan to do with that key? Be careful. Something fishy is going on at this school. I will. See you around. Plus doing business with you. It's been a pleasure. Yes. Money bags. literally glass <laughs> or literally grass either way that's funny <laughs> this is the literally grass card it's literally grass that's all <laughs> so i assume we never need to use this ever again How about you touch some? Make me. So, we did Monty's quest. Lily is last. So now it's like bugs and nugget. You need a special item from the teacher? Okay, yeah, we have that. We have the pass.
Tell on bugs for robbing you and say you won't help the team. Okay. Okay. to my money he did interesting what's it in for me no way i must say i am not a fan of my darling students telling me no i sure hope nothing bad happens to you or the rest of the bad children that would be just dreadful rip fat tits yep the bad children bugs and nugget and now you you must all be really good friends sure we are anyway run along just know that I'll be watching closely. Right. Hmm. And say you won't help the teacher. Okay. Why just me? I just maybe I just <laughs> maybe I just advance the next room. I don't know. I'm not really sure. Psst. Kid, hey kid. I heard about what the teacher was trying to do to me. Old Applegate has had it out for me for a while now. It's nice to know that someone is willing to stand up to her. No problem. Yeah, it actually is a problem. He's probably setting something up to get you in trouble as we speak. That's how I got my first two strikes. If she gets me again, I'll be expelled. Would that be so bad? Considering the last kid to be expelled was that missing kid, Billy, yeah, it would be bad to be expelled. I'll keep that in mind. We should work together to get her before she gets us. I'm in. Smart move. Take this. If she tries to make anything funny with you, don't be afraid to use it. A knife? Yeah, it's a knife. Look, something awful is happening at this school. Everyone knows it, but no one talks about it. I'm not about to go down without a fight. Good point. We need to find a way to get the old gal alone. I don't want any witnesses tattling. I have a lunch pass. Well, look at you, little Miss Teacher's pet. That's going to make this a whole lot easier. So after morning time's over, you're going to have to have a very special lunch with the teacher. And just kill her? Pretty much, just wait until her back is turned and strike. I'll be waiting outside. Will she turn her back? Hmm, good point. We're gonna need a distraction of some sort during your special lunch. See if you could buy something from Monty to do the job. Alright. Got anything to cause a distraction? Sorry, I don't have anything like that at the moment. But I'll, but I'll tell you what, I'm pretty handy with gadgets. If you could find me some sort of device, I could rig it to do what you need to do. Where can I find one? The principal gives them out to kids he finds suspicious. I saw a nugget with one the other day. But he likes having it, only gives to kids who are trying to be his friend. Okay. What are you busy with? You are curious about the ways of Nugget? Interesting, perhaps you could be of some use to Nugget. Go back to the start and see if you can get it from Nugget. Okay, let's try that. I did have a bunch of actions that I didn't use, so yeah. That's probably a wise call. I forgot to get the money. I forgot to get the money. <laughs> uh Is there any advantage to not getting all your money from your piggy bank? Like, I don't really know what the advantage to that any of that is. Okay, let's do the teacher thing and then talk to Nugget. 
Well, on days you don't need it, you don't, you don't have to talk to bugs. Ah, it's just like a few things to skip, though, you know? Have you changed your mind for the good of the children? Still no. I'll be your friend. What is your offering? Oh, I have a flower. This was given to you by Cindy, yes? There is a great love in this flower. She really cares for you more than the other seven boyfriends she's had this month. Perhaps you do know love. Perhaps. There are things Nugget has seen, but it's old to forget. Nugget forgot love. I do not wish to forget anymore. Take this Nugget of friendship. Why? Bring together the other Nuggets of friendship by recess and Nugget will reveal all. How many are there? There are five total. Once you are already have, come see me during morning time and Nugget will tell you how to get more. Yeah, I guess. Nugget also insists you hold on to this strange device. Should you succeed in this task, Nugget will reveal to you what it does. If I fail, Nugget will still reveal what it does. Great. Pretty Lily also knows a great deal about the device. Perhaps going, gaining her trust would benefit Nugget's friend. Suppose it would. One more talking now. Shoo. Okay. Now we go to the next room. Here we go. I'm in. Better be paranoid and alive than careless and missing. Good point. Right. I have a lunch pass. And we talk to Monty about this. Okay, here we go. You could find me some sort of device. I could bring it to do whatever you need to do. You mean this, like this thing? Oh yeah, that's exactly what I'm talking about. It cost you a dollar fifty to get this done. You good with that? Yep. Okay then, just so just a solder here, rewire that timer pass through that capacitor, set the receiver to the correct frequency, more techno babble to make me seem smart, and it's done. What's it do? Here's the remote. All you have to do is press that button and this little doodad you gave me will pop like a firecracker. Cool. It's only good for one use, though, so be careful with it. Got it. Well, did you get something to cause a distraction? Yep. Go ahead and stick it under one of the front tables. You'll be glad you did. <laughs> yes. Well, I don't know if there's a reason to put it anywhere else, but okay. Okay, that's it. Now all we have to do is wait for the lunch bell to ring. We'll probably avoid being seen together from this point on so she doesn't get suspicious. Sure thing. Uh, I don't think the, these are enough actions to... Um, these aren't enough actions to sell or uh, to... To like... Um, what am I trying to say? Oh wait, let's talk to Nugget. Why not? Nugget's friend returns. Does he wish to continue on his quest to retrieve the five nuggets of friendship? I guess so. Nugget is pleased with your persistence. One of nuggets is hidden within this room. Nugget holds the other. You must find the hidden nugget before you can get the one nugget holds. Any hints on where it is? The classroom is not that big. You would do well to search in many areas, perhaps in the little cubbies. But beware, teacher does not like snoopers. Right, so I would use J Jerome to distract the teacher and then get the nugget. Yeah. We don't really need to do any of that, though, because we're doing bugs as quests, so... I'm just gonna sell these and move on. I want to... Okay. <laughs> okay, kids, that's the lunch bell. Let's go down to the cafeteria for a nutritious meal. I hear we're having slop today. How exciting. I want to have lunch with you! You can't see me, but I pointed at the screen. Oh, fiddlesticks, there goes my smoke break. Very well. You can have a special lunch with me today. Excellent. The rest of you run along to the cafeteria.
Having special lunch with my favorite student instead of getting a smoke break is one of my favorite things about teaching. Here's a McGlob silly meal. Knock yourself out. Thanks. Go on, have a bite. It's delicious and possibly nutritious. Activate distraction. Oh, my, 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 my! What in the dickens was that? Did it come from in here? Ah! You little bastard! I'm gonna... Oh, dear. You... I heard her scream, so it's done, right? Wow, I can't believe you actually did it. Take the knife out of her. It's got our fingerprints all over it. She's probably got a phone on her, too. I'll take that. That's the bell. Let's get out of here. Reese's is about to start, and I don't want anyone to notice we were missing at lunch. Come see me at Reese's, and I'll help you hide that knife. Yeah, I assume if I talk to the janitor there, he kills me. Teacher didn't even drop epic loot. What a fucking blowout. What an awful wipe. <laughs> hey, headphones. There you go. Okay. My headphones fucked over for a moment. Okay. Okay, it's clear someone knows that teacher is missing. Otherwise, that old lunatic wouldn't be watching us while we're out here. We need to hide that knife before we can go back inside. Where do we hide it? The only place I'm seeing is that whole nugget dug. Only problem is that nugget can be territorial, and we're not exactly friends. Maybe you could convince him to bury it for us? Damn it, I did need to do nuggets thing. Okay, I, I do have to restart the day. I, I, I had to actually get the nuggets earlier. Nugget's friend has failed the test. Nugget's friend did not return in time. Oh, sorry about that. It is fine. Nugget knows where Billy is. Why did you just scream that? Strange. Nugget's failure of a friend should be in many pieces now. Where is the strange device? I don't have it anymore. This displeases Nugget greatly. Be gone. Nugget no longer wishes to be your friend. Can I hide something in the hole? First you fail Nugget and then you ask to... Ask to add to the Nugget Cave? Where does it end? Just this one thing. Oh my, this knife has known mad things. Nugget can tell. Nugget does not want it in the Nugget Cave. Just do it for what could have been. Very well. If you will stop pestering Nugget, you may add the knife of evil to the Nugget, nugget Cave. Thanks. Now be gone. Nugget has matters to attend to with this unhealthy addition to the cave. Sure, bye. Okay, I didn't actually need to, uh... Yeah, I guess I didn't need to uh, actually get the Nuggets of Friendship. Well, did you get rid of it? It's gone. Hot damn! I can't believe we were about to get away with this! Just chill for the rest of Recess, and everything will work out. What about her phone? Don't you worry about that. Just keep your eyes open and be ready when the time is right. Okay. Okay, you rotten kids, that's the bell. Get your worthless hides back inside. Go back inside. Children, I have some bad news. If you look to your right, you will see your formerly unstabbed teacher. Oh my god, is there a murderer on the loose? It's probably the creepy janitor. We've already cleared the janitor. He was in the cafeteria selling biscuit balls when her death occurred. She had it coming to her. What are you going to do about it, Dad? First Billy, now this? We're not safe at the school. Wait, why do you have the key? I just picked it up at the beginning. You're gonna die? Oh. Ah, uh, yeah, okay. <laughs> I just picked it up at the beginning of the day because I just thought, why not? Like, I didn't really know what the consequence would be. Like, I don't remember. I already told you I don't remember the sequencing of anything. <laughs> Remember the principal searches you? I remember right this very moment, yes. At this particular moment, when it is literally about to happen, I do remember. This is totally gonna tank my sales for the rest of the week. Enough! Now we die. Nugget likes the way the teacher smells now. Shut up, weirdo! Take one of your pills or something! Anyway, I need to search all of you to make sure you aren't carrying anything that could be used to kill your teacher. We'll start with you, the one covered in blood. Empty your pockets. Doesn't look like you have anything on you. Okay, let's go ahead and search Bugs next. Oh, look, he doesn't give a shit about the key. <laughs> he doesn't care about the key. <laughs> hmm, 
Doesn't look like you have anything incriminating on you either. Damn, now I owe the lunch lady 20 bucks. Okay, well, it looks like no one here is responsible for killing the teacher. That being said, I'm sending you all home because, well, your teacher is dead. He didn't give a shit. Maybe he cares if you have the mold on you or something, but that would that all that also doesn't make sense. That isn't really that's not really congruent though with him not caring about the key. <laughs> well, we did it. We got away with Moida. Trust me when I say this was for the best. I hope so. You still have the phone? I handed it off to you while I was walking up to get searched. Pretty sneaky, huh? Yeah, it was it was, it was. You know what? Why don't you keep it? A little token of my appreciation. Maybe you could use it for something on another day. Cool, thanks. This was fun. Maybe we can do it again someday. I'll see you around, kid. Yeah, see you. Yay! Are we going to finish this game today? No way, because we have to go get the Monster Mon cards, right? Uh, okay, now we do Nugget and then Lily. Right, we need the flower. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's get the flower. <laughs> this is the teacher's phone that bugs took off her corpse. There are contacts for various staff members of the school saved in here. Yeah, sure. I remember that the phone you use in like one of the in like the final mission in Lily's mission to like distract the principal. I don't know if I need it here or not though, so I'm just gonna have it. I don't know if I need either of these, so I guess I'll take the key because we've already used the uh, the pass. The game never explains why we have Groundhog Day powers, but maybe the third game will explain why we have Groundhog Day powers. I'll be your friend. What is your offering? I have a flower. We, we did this conversation, perhaps. Take this nugget of friendship. Why? Bring together the other nuggets of friendship by recess. A nugget will reveal all. How many are there? There are five total. One you already have. Comes to be doing in morning, and Nugget will tell you how to get more. Okay. Nugget also insists you hold on to this strange device. Should you succeed in this task, Nugget will reveal to you what it does. Pretty Lily also knows a great deal about the device. Perhaps getting her trust would benefit be a benefit to Nugget's... Uh, would benefit Nugget's friend. I suppose it would. No more talking now. Shoo. Okay. Hmm. Nugget might be autistic and based, but he is kind of rude sometimes. He's like, shoo, like you're like you're a pest, you know? Uh, I don't really know if I care about the rest of the apples. I'll talk to Lily because I haven't done so in a while. <laughs> That's what makes him based. You are a pest. Hey, I'm a time traveling four year old trying to solve a mystery. I'm not a pest. I'm working out, so I'm not giving you help for this. That's fine. You don't need to. Oh, um, hey, I'm Lily. You probably heard about what happened to my brother, Billy. I haven't. You haven't? It's been over the news. He went missing a few days ago. Sorry to hear that. Hard to trust anyone here. Cindy's been trying to put gum in my hair. Why? I don't know, but if I were you, I'd stay away from her. She's really mean. Thanks for the tip. Okay. We don't need to do Lily's mission. So we're just gonna. Maybe I sell things to. Nah. I don't care. Well, if I make it, if I if there's more actions I needed to take, then it's I don't give a shit. All right, hello Nugget. Nugget's friend returns. Does he wish to continue his quest? Yep. Be back with it. Here's the Nugget. Oh wait, we need to distract the teacher. Oh, I'm stupid. It's fine. Yep. 
I might have to restart the day just to get the yo-yo at the beginning. Fine. Okay. <laughs> get over here, kid! You blew it! Have you found the second nugget of friendship? Yes. Wonderful! Nugget is impressed. The trial of the cubbies is, a nor is normally very difficult for Nugget's potential friends. What's next? Do you see the pretty lily over there? Nugget likes the pretty lily. Nugget has written the pretty lily a pretty poem. You are to deliver to her. We only have one uh, apple left, though, so we need to restart. So, which is totally fine. Because I, because I remember, as I do this, I remember the solutions. So it's totally fine. We needed the distraction and all that. So, yeah, we just got the yo yo. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, that makes. If we, if we don't have very much money, then we don't use an apple on bugs. Oh, that's kind of stupid. I'm kind I feel. Now I feel. Now I do feel stupid. I don't care. Unless it really fucks everything up right now. We have the yo-yo. Do I gain... I mean, I have apples left. I could just gain... Why not? I don't care. I'm going to She gave this to you? Wow, she can't even do her own dirty work. I'm ugly enough without having gum in my hair, so thanks for not doing it. You're not ugly? Oh, thanks. I guess City has been getting to me lately. I appreciate the compliment. You're nice, thanks. I'm not really looking to be friends right now, but I do trust you for whatever that's worth. I'll see you around, sure. Yeah. Yep. Nugget. What's next? Do you see the pretty lily over there? Nugget likes the pretty lily. Nugget has written the pretty lily a pretty poem. You are to deliver to her. Yep. Oh, hey, I'm glad you were nice to me this morning and all, but I'm not really looking for a morning buddy right now. I have a letter from Nugget. Oh, I didn't know that he was capable of having complex emotions. It's still a sweet gesture. I just wish I could read it. I guess I'll go ask the teacher to read it for me. Okay, then. <laughs> um, Miss Applegate? Yes, Lily, what is it? Nugget just gave me this love letter and I was wondering... Oh! Gather round, children! Nugget wrote Lily a love letter. Oh, no, no, no. Nugget's letter is only to be read by the pretty Lily. Nugget likes pretty Lily. He also misses her brother, Billy. Please do not continue. Nugget likes the lily's hair. Nugget likes to smell her chair. Nugget, do we need to schedule another trip to the school counselor? This is getting pretty weird. Nugget thinks you should stop then. Maybe just a few more lines. Nugget said no! Okay, fine. Fine, weirdo. As you were, children. <laughs> well, that was mortifying. Please go away. <laughs> okay! <laughs> That was mortifying. <laughs> uh, 
Ah, ah, ah. I delivered the letter. Nugget noticed. Sorry, it happened like that. That was less than ideal. Still, you delivered the letter as you said you would. For that, you have earned the third nugget of friendship. Auto modded again. Let's go take a look. Uh huh. Uh, I'm gonna assume that Twitch won't ban me for un-auto modding that. <laughs> Hooray! Come join Nugget at lunch, and you will be told how to continue your quest. Sure. Okay, kids, that's the lunch bell. Yep. Did I unmute myself? Yes, I did. Nugget is, you know, he's our nugger, is what he is. Big Mother Nuggers. Are you ready to get to do the quest for the Nuggets of Friendship? Sure, I guess. Excellent, it should happen any minute now. What should happen? That. Every single day, Bugs throws nasty slop at poor Nugget. But today, Nugget has a new potential friend. Hey, that's our word. You call him a nugga? <laughs> oh, Jesus. What am I supposed to do about it? All a nugget needs from you is to make sure he eats this. Do this simple task and the next nugget of friendship is yours. What did you do to this nugget? Nugget poisoned it. You want me to kill Bugs? Obviously, Bugs is a bully. He must be taught a lesson. You say so? No way a worm like you is going to be sitting next to me. I need you to eat this. What? Why? What is it? It's a nugget. Yeah, I can see that. Why the heck would I want to eat something you gave me? Because otherwise you'll look like a sissy. What? Who around here thinks I'm a sissy because I won't eat a stupid nugget? Cindy. What? Cindy doesn't think I'm a sissy? Well, she won't if you eat this nugget. Yeah, give me the nugget. I'll show her. You showed her, and then he dies. Well, did you do it? He ate it. Excellent, this pleases Nugget greatly. Now we will wait for him to, oh, there he goes. You have earned this Nugget of Friendship. Yes, sir. How do I get the last one? Nugget appreciates your enthusiasm. The last Nugget of Friendship can be acquired at recess. Nugget will see you then. Okay, see you then. Um, also, what? Nugget's love letter did the opposite of its intended effects. Instead of making pretty Lily feel good, it made her feel bad. It was a weird poem. Good Nugget's potential friend, go check on the pretty Lily for him. She looks quite red over there by herself. I suppose I could. Nugget appreciates that. We will meet by the Nugget Cave at recess. Can't wait. Hey, sorry for freaking out back there. I didn't mean to take it out on you. I know Nugget is weird. You didn't know he would say those things in that letter. Yeah. I want you to have this donut as an apology. It's okay if you say no, but I'd like you to have it. Also, I just noticed that because of, um, because of this doing Nugget's quest, Lily hasn't entered the hallway. Usually around this time, if you don't do anything with Lily, she enters the hallway to snoop on the, the principal. Thanks. There you go. I'm going to finish lunch alone, but it's nice to know that we're okay now. I'll see you later. See you later. We got a new hint. I'm trying to locate my hands at the keyboard. We got a new hint of some kind? Okay, but what does the donut have to do with Nugget's quest? <laughs> if I'm gonna be honest. Do I just sell my stuff? I guess I do. I have so, I have so many items in my inventory. Okay, now we talk to Nugget again. So, it has come to this. Nugget's friend prepares himself to seek the final Nugget of Friendship. Yep. Sorry about that, my headphones are whack as fuck. Okay. Do you still possess the strange device Nugget gave you upon the start of our quest? This thing? Nugget has a simple request regarding the device. What is it? Give the device to Nugget. Okay. There. Now we may speak of the device. Why did you put it over there? 
The device listens. It knows what Nugget says. And if it does not like what it hears, it explodes. Why not just leave it over there? Principal knows when it is left behind. Principal knows and will hurt poor Nugget like he hurt poor Billy. So what do we do with it? We must convince it to explode. We must do so properly. Do you see the statue of Principal over there? It watches us much like the device listens. We're going to blow up the statue? No, no, silly. You're going to blow up the statue. How? Put the device behind the statue. Once you have done that, talk to the pretty Lily about poor Billy. The device does not like it when you talk about poor Billy. Got it? Good luck. Return here when it is done. Place the device. I know he did it. I don't know why, but I know he did. The principal took Billy! Ah, what have you done? We're gonna get in so much trouble. I hope you have a plan. Uh, maybe. Oh my golly, good gosh. Why the heck did you two blow up the statue of the principal? He's going to be furious. What? You think I did this? It was all him. He blew up the statue. You can't expect me to believe that, can you, Lily? You spent all day out here staring at that silly thing, and your feelings toward the principal aren't exactly kind. Oh, you do- we- I- Donut, I want a donut. I want a donut, too. Yeah. No, this is so unfair! I was in the wrong place at the wrong time! I'm sorry, Lily, but you're gonna get- have to get the principal to believe you. Go to the office. But- but I- go! As for you, young man, I don't want to see you become as bitter as Lily toward our principal. Just give me one reason not to send you to his office and you're off the hook. You like donuts? Tee hee! Does it look like I like donuts? I'm on a diet right now. But one donut won't hurt, right? Um, nom, 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 nom. Oh, sweet Jesus, that's good. Yeah, you're totally off the hook. Go play now. Will do. Hey, Nugget, you got the chick you're like, you like, uh, killed. How do you like that? You have done well to blow up the statue. Take this final nugget of friendship and know that you are truly Nugget's friend. It is time for you to enter Nugget Cave in its true form. I'm ready. Excellent, but first, Nugget must do something. <laughs> Whee! This teacher kind of reminds me of the teacher I had in fourth grade. Yeah, teachers, teachers for like our sort of g generation of children, teachers at early school and middle school were one of two things. They were, or sometimes both. They were some fat woman, some like blatantly fat woman, sometimes like a thick bitch, but usually a fat woman or a grandma. <laughs> And it's only once you get to, like, the upper echelons of middle school and high school that you see, like, like, the old men science teachers. You know? Maybe, like, a, like, a, like, a 20-some-year-old a math teacher that's a man, you know? Welcome to the Nugget Cave. Behold, it's Nuggety Goodness. Please have a look around. Okay. Oh, a Monster Mon card. The Monster Barn card lying here next to some disintegrating skulls. Take it. That is a memorial for Nugget's good friend Billy. The flowers have started to die. Much like Nugget's hope that he will ever see Billy again. Nugget misses Billy very much. Place flower. Please do not leave things on Nugget's. Oh, you're, you're leaving a flower. That is quite, quite nice. Do you miss Billy as much as Nugget? Yes. He was the only one before you who found the five nuggets of friendship. He, Nugget, Nugget can't do this anymore. Do what? Billy told Nugget many things before he went missing. Nugget took the principal's pills to help forget, but Nugget does not wish to forget anymore. What do you know? The pills have already done their work. Nugget does not know anything anymore, but Billy gave Nugget something. Something that may help you know what Nugget forgot. What is it? Nugget left it in his cubby. Nugget will present it to you after show and tell. Just get through the rest of the day and Nugget will find you after school. Okay. That is the bell. We must depart from the Nugget Cave. I will see you again soon. Yep, Lily is fucking dead. I don't know where Bugs is. Is 
that a chicken nugget? Why are you showing that? It is one of Nugget's nuggets. It means that this one of, is one of Nugget's friends. Right. I hope you know what you're getting into. Being Nugget's can be Nugget's friend can be challenging. Anyway, who's next? Someone with something more interesting than a Nugget, please. Well, children, that was a fun show and tell. It's never a fun show and tell because when you cast show and tell, you're always going to drop omniscience on me, you piece of shit. Fuck you. <laughs> Facts! <laughs> Nugget is ready to give you what Billy gave to Nugget. It is a mysterious note. Nugget can read, but cannot understand the words left behind by poor Billy. But what should I do with it? The pretty Lily is quite upset over Billy's disappearance. Perhaps she would know what to do. Nugget, we got her killed. <laughs> with our stupid plan. Okay. Nugget is quite happy to have a friend again. Thank you. Goodbye. Bye. I guess we're going to beat the game and then spend the rest of the stream on uh, Monstermon cards. Wizard Worm. <laughs> I did not think we would beat this game in two streams. This is the Wizard Worm card, not to be confused with Mage Maggot or Sorcerer Serpent. We read these before. I don't know why they have exclamation points above them. So, Monty, Nugget, and Bugs in order to complete Lily's mission. Okay. Let's not take money because of the... There's so many more collectibles, though. Yeah, like, I, yeah, we're going to spend the rest of this... After we beat the game, we'll redo the days again in order to get all the Monster Mon cards. Let's go without money and see if that changes things. I want apples at the beginning. Because having money makes bugs talk to you, and when he talks to you, uh, he takes not just your money, but an apple just to talk to him. So what's the second hint? Cigarettes in the schoolyard. Ah, uh, can I afford them? One dollar, yes. Do Lily's or uh, Cindy's stupid thing to get Lily's trust. Actually, wait, no. Um, talk to Lily first, then do it. I'm sleepy. See you Wednesday, because I'm hopefully still health healthy then. Well, you have a good night then, man. Hopefully we see you around then. We'll be playing World of Horror again. More than likely. Ah, oh, we initiate this conversation with this. Okay. I have. What is that? It looks like Billy's handwriting. Where did you get this? What do you know? Nugget gave it to me. I knew Nugget was holding out on me. Do you know what it says? I can't read as well as my brother could. No. Well, then I have to find someone who can. Hurry. Okay. Uh, Monty can read. I need you to read this for me. Sure, I'll read it for you, but it's gonna cost you a buck. Deal? Okay. Okay, let's see here. Jeez, this handwriting is atrocious. It says something about a hatch in the principal's office that can be opened with the code written below. What's the code? That's the handwriting gets especially terrible. It's gonna take me a little while to decipher. I'll try to have it figured out for you by lunch, okay? Well, what did it say? Something about opening a secret hatch in the principal's office. A secret hatch? That's probably where he keeps... Here he's keeping Billy! We've got to get in there! We have to save him! Only... What? I need a way to get in there without the principal knowing. I've got a plan, but it requires getting a phone and the key to the principal's office. I've got a phone. No way! That's so great! Now all I need is the key to the office. I've got the key. Wow! You have everything I need! This is so great! I can tell you my plan now. What is it? 
I need you to actually get sent to the office alone. Once inside, you need to find that hatch. How do I get sent there alone? Nugget has to be in on this somehow. I'm sure he could get you there, whether he knows it or not. Just pressure him, and I'm sure something will happen. Good luck. Thanks. We also may have a run-in with the hall monitor at lunch today. We should get ready to deal with him. Got it. Oh, one more thing. If the principal gives you a strange device, do not come talk to me until you get rid of it. Why? It's a listening device. The principal gives it to anyone he finds suspicious. He had me carry one for weeks before he gave up. I'm pretty sure Nugget has one now, so be careful. Right. So, yeah. What happened to Billy? Whoops. Damn this headphone. Okay. Who told you that? Oh, you know, word just, uh, gets around, you know? Doesn't matter how I know. It's that I do know. I'm not sad about Billy. You're not? Then why are you so interested in his disappearance? I'm not. I've been doing this a long time. I know a lie when I see one. I know you're upset about this. The question is, why? I don't recall you and Billy being close after his disappointment? Disappearance? <laughs> Lily is my girlfriend? <laughs> That's kind of... <laughs> I... Fuck it. Lily is my girlfriend? <laughs> ah, yes. Young love. So fast to build even faster crumble. Suppose Lily would spread her misery to those around her. Just be careful not to get dragged down with her. I won't. Good. Now, before you head back to class, go ahead and take this from me. Don't worry about what it does. Just know that you need it. Um, okay. Now, run along back to class. Run along. And if I look at that, he's going to shoot me, so... <sighs> Say, the principal didn't happen to have, give, have given you anything, did he? He gave me this thing. Oh, that's not what I meant. Did he give you anything else? No. What a shame. So now that we have the listening device, we can't talk to Lily about any of this. Right. Now I have to find a way to get rid of this thing. I know, I know that uh, we get that that Monty can turn it, but will he do it in absence of Bugs's quest? Uh, it doesn't look like he'll do that in the absence of Bugs's quest, and we also cannot talk to Lily to advance her quest. While we are doing this. So, while we're in this room. So that means we do need to go back to the beginning of the day, get money, do the thing with bugs, and then come back here do and get bugs to turn this thing into a uh, distraction device so that I can talk to Lily. 
I think if I talk to Lily right now, we I explode. But just to make sure, let's see. Well, did you see the hatch? Do you know where Billy is? I couldn't find it. Darn it, I'm not going in there blind. We'll set to try again tomorrow. Okay. Oh! Oh, wait, I'm... Were you listening to my conversation about Nugget? What? No! You shouldn't accuse authority figures of eavesdropping. I know what I know, because I'm the principal. Got it? Okay, sorry. Oh, we can get this instead. We can get the pills instead. And then we can talk to Lily about it. Okay, hold on. Okay, okay. Don't think of these drugs. Think of them as portable therapy to help you cope with your feelings. Okay, thanks. Take one right now. No. Take it or there will be consequences. Fine. There you go. Isn't that better? How do you feel? I feel good. Excellent. I also want you to hold on to this for me. It's a little gadget, but don't worry about what it does. Fuck. Okay. Fine. No! I have to not do the pills. I have to specifically not get the pills. Lily is my friend. Lily doesn't have any friends. I'm starting to lose my patience. I need to know what you know about Billy. I don't know anything. No, I suppose you don't. At least, not after this. <laughs> yeah, I, I know what I'm supposed to do. Lily. I don't, I don't know why Lily is my girlfriend is the one that works. But look under the rug. Whoa there, no need to stoop around my office. Get out of here. Sorry. Ugh, okay. The problem is I still think we're about to explode and we have to restart the day though. You know where Billy is? I saw the hatch. Yep, there we go, we die. <laughs> yeah, so we have to we have to do Bugs' thing in order to talk to Monty to transform this stupid device into the thing so that I can then talk to Lily. So I need the money. I need the money. Yes. No way. Okay. Okay, now that activates bugs. I've got the phone. I've got the key. The problem is that now I need to get sent to the principal's office again somehow. So I'm gonna have to like... But can I... Okay, here we go.
Uh, yeah. Oh, God. Right. He likes kids that make other kids go ma right. Uh, okay, that's not the correct sequence either. Okay, uh, hmm. Fuck! So, no, we can't do anything related to bugs in the morning. We actually can't at all. Son of a bitch. Um... Oh, God, I'm trying to rack my brain around this shit. I know... Yeah, I already read that. Why does it pretend that it's new if I've already read that? Okay. She said we'll try again tomorrow, so I definitely... That's not the sequence, definitely. So I can't do anything related to bugs. Because he takes an apple from me if I have... He takes an apple from me if I have too much money. Alright, we get the, we, uh, do, wait, can we look at this trash can? Oh! Cool, we have a new card, okay. So how the fuck do I get rid of this thing? I can't talk to Lily. Wait a minute. Can I just sell him this thing? No. If I talk to Lily about this, I just die. So I don't know how to, um... Do I have to talk to the... Wait a minute. No, 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 no. If the principal gives me the pill, like, he, he always gives you the pills, and he always gives you this device. Is there, like, a, a, a conversation route, though, where he gives you neither? Could it be that there's a conversation route where he only gives me the pills and not the device? Could that be it? Let's try that. Maybe there's a conversation path. Oh, wow, I'm, I am like the most retarded person on Earth. Now we're going to give the drugs to the teacher because she's a fucking addict. Say, the principal didn't happen to have you. 
you have given you anything, did he? He gave me some pills. Oh, lucky day, you wouldn't mind if your lovely teacher had one, would you? Be my guest. Good boy. Oh, that's nice. Thank you for that. Go on and enjoy the rest of your morning time. I know I will. Me too. Okay, I don't have the device. Well, did you see the hatch? Do you know where Billy is? I saw the hatch. Excellent, now we move on to the next phase. We need a way to get into the principal's office while he's not in there. How do we do that? We need a way to get him out and a way to get us in. I think he can I think I can lure him out if I if uh I can call him. Okay. Monty said he'll have the code for the hatch at lunch, right? Come see me then. Okay? There's one more thing though. This all goes horribly long. We're going to need a probable cause for doing what we did. We need some actual evidence. Where do we get that? Well, if there's a mess in this school, who cleans it up? I'm guessing the janitor has something to do with this. See if he's doing anything suspicious. Got it. Okay. So we need the bathroom pass. That's it, though. Yeah, crap is three. Now that you'll get a chance to use it, the bell just rang. Get out of here. Oh, man. Gander is a funny, murderous person, yes. Okay. So we have the finger, which is fucking absurd. Uh, yeah. Let's you talk to Monty first or Lily first. I don't know if it matters. Did you find anything? We need some insurance before we do anything crazy. I found this severed finger. That's disgusting! Oh god, I really hope that's not Billy's finger. Oh jeez, okay. Whew. It works anyway. It doesn't have to be Billy's. A severed finger is reason not to panic. So it works? Sure, just get it away from me. It's so gross. So what now? Decide to find out what happened to my brother. Did you get the code from Monty? Not yet. Go get it then. Come see me when you have it. Yep. I figured you'd be seeing me around. Slop's no good. I don't think anyone's brave enough to try the biscuit from the janitor. Did you decipher the note? Psh, of course I did. I wrote on the back of the note. Here you go. Have fun with that. Thanks. <laughs> this entire thing is... Oh, we can't read. So he deciphers the note. And then writes on the back what it says you mean how it already had something written on it <laughs> i'm just gonna i'm just gonna trace the other letters on the back so you can read it <laughs> what how do you <laughs> oh god that's so funny Whoops. Sorry, I lost track of my fingers on the keyboard. Okay. Well, did you get it? Yep. 4851. Yep. What's next? I already paid off the lunch lady. We need to head to the bathroom. From there, we use the phone to call the principal's office and lure him to the classroom. I'll meet you there. What the? Whoa there, little hombre. You're way too, you be wrong, be too young to be bringing your girlfriend into the bathroom with you. Gotta wait till at least sixth grade for that. I gotta take you both to the principal. No, you don't understand. This is so important. You can't stop us. There must be something we can do. I don't know. Guess I could let you guys off the hook if you gave me a pack of cigarettes. I just ran out. Ah! Oh. 
No, two fifty is enough for the cigarettes and the and the the deciphering. I can't believe I forgot about that, because I didn't forget about it the first time we tried this, but then I immediately forgot this time. Okay. It's fine. We know what the sequence is. Turlet? Time goes by fast in this universe, doesn't it? Wow, thanks, little bro. Yeah, go do whatever. Times are changing, I guess. They sure are. Good thing you bring those cigarettes. Now, give me the phone. I have a very important call to make to the principal. Um, hello, Mr. Principal? Lily, is that you? How are you calling me with your teacher's phone? Put her on. No, but if you want to save her life, you better get over to the classroom now. What's the meaning of this? Lily, answer me, young lady. Click. That should do it. Yep, I can hear him heading down the hall. Let's go. Come on, open the door. We have to hurry. Unlock. I can't believe it. We're in. Where is the hatch? Under the rug in the corner. What the? There's no place to enter the code. This lock takes a key. What are we going to do? Open the drawer. There's a fancy key. Yeah, I probably can get a lot of the Monster Mon cards. Take the key. I found it. Well, what are you waiting for? Put in the lock in that. <laughs> Use it. There's a hatch on the floor. Dried blood stains. Dried blood stains the surrounding carpet. It's locked. Open the hatch. 
Oh, I don't know if you need to pull up the guide guide, but thank you. If that's a pain in the ass, you don't have to bother. Okay, that did it. Hey, um, before we go down there, I just want to say thanks. I would have gotten this far without you. No problem. It's almost like I, you supplied the plan, but I literally supplied everything else, you know? Whatever happens down there, stay close. We can do this. Go down the hatch. Wow, I can't believe this is under the... Billy! What? What has he done to you? We have to find a way to release him. Hurry! Oh right, yeah, this room is this is a is a thing. No, we're dead. <laughs> yeah, 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 no. Okay, not the blue one. Not the blue one. The blue said like it was releasing everything. Yellow. Yellow. Green. Reverting mutating mutation process on contents of tank 2. It worked! You fixed him! Now we just have to find a way to get him out of there! I believe we have to hit blue on the principal, maybe? Wait. No, we need to... I... I remember something important. I remember something important. Yep, that's what I remembered. I need to blend this one. Okay. It worked! You fixed him! Now we just find a way to get him out of there! Ah, the lights went off! I can't see a thing! Get away from my experiments! I knew it! I knew you were behind all this! You had my brother the whole time! Yes, Lily. You have been a particular thorn in my side. I knew I shouldn't have chosen him. Chosen him for what? What's the meaning of all this? I suppose you should know what all this is about before I execute you. I would like to know. These creatures live deep beneath the school. They give off certain chemicals that affect the human body in interesting ways. Like how? I've been putting it in pills. It has a different effect on each person who tries it. Miss Applegate seems to have de developed a dependence on them. What about Nugget? It fixes him. I don't know what's wrong with him to begin with, but they seem to make him better. What about Billy? The creatures in the tanks beside him are all quite hostile. I was looking to replicate the chemical production in humans to reduce the risk factors. That doesn't explain Billy. Nugget was going to be my original test subject, but Billy stumbled upon one of the creature's bodies in the janitor's closet while he was dealing with a dog or something. Wow. Okay, so that's it. That's everything you need to know. I have to kill you now, unfortunately. Can't have this getting out. Blue. Releasing contents of all viable tanks. So the pills remove Nugget's autism? <laughs> I guess so, yeah. Cthulhu pills. No! What have you done? Stay away from me! Oh no! <laughs> that's not Cthulhu, that's Folk Kid. Billy, wake up! Come on! Uh, what? Where am I? What's going on, Lily? He's alive! He's saved! We did it! 
Can can we get out of here? I want to go home. Of course we can, silly, but first we have to go to show and tell. Let's get out of here. Well, look who's back from skipping recess. Nugget's friend has returned. Billy is free from the evil principal. Shut it, weirdo. I hope you all have a good excuse. I'm sorry, Miss Applegate, but we found Billy. I was in a vat under the school. I see, but that's no excuse for leaving a supervised area. Go to the principal's office. Um, the principal kind of exploded. So there's no one around to sign my checks? I don't think so. Okay, then. Bye. I guess we could leave too, then. That's real as fuck, to be honest. <laughs> I don't even know what you mean by that. Oh, right. Uh, you, nobody is signing my checks? Okay, fuck off. <laughs> Principal's dead? I'm Audi 5000. Can you read me the cards you already got in the bedroom? I have a guide. Okay, yeah, yeah. I don't know if I'll ever be able to come up with words to thank you for what you did today. Yeah, you saved my life. There's nothing I could do that would be fitting. Well, maybe there is one thing. You're right, so here it is. This is an ultra-rare Monstermon card. Our dad works in the company that makes them. This is the only one in existence. You could also have this collector's guide. It tells you where to find the Monstermon cards. Thanks for everything you've done today. We should get home. I'm sure our parents are wondering where I am about right now. Goodbye. Nice. Blue Eyes Gold Dragon. <laughs> we saved Billy! We'll let, we'll let this play, even though we're gonna be doing stuff after it. This game, this, this version of this game is like $5. It's very, very cheap. And you know, for like, what is going to be about four hours of playing with a bit of help. Um, I guess for somebody who's completely blind, this is like six to eight hours of trial and error. Um, and I think it's uh, I think it's pretty funny the way it is. And it's kind of apparent why it was able to get a slightly higher uh, budget sequel and why it's going to get a threequel, you know. Billy, I'm sorry we saved you, but we were too late to stop the experiment and you're physically disfigured. But this is how I usually look. Oh. <laughs> oh God. I wonder what happens if you press the uh, the debutation button on. Um. Remember the route to save Teddy in K two. Yeah. Yeah, I do. I I would like that. Yeah. I wonder what happens if you try to debutate any of the weird Cthulhu creatures or the fuckhead creatures. Ow. Ouchie. Okay. We only have five out of 25. You don't think anything happens to them? Ah, oh, okay. This is the... Blue Eyes Gold Dragon, please don't sue. Okay, so the ones we have are the Blue Eyes, Literally Grass, Wizard Worm, then we have Tornado Fly, and Sneaky Snake. Those are the ones that we have. Everything else we do not have. We do have a billion hints. <laughs> Literally grass, bro. They put a planes into the game. Holy shit, a basic planes? Man, we're gonna get fucking swords, dude. If you have hints, no need for the guide. Yeah, well then just no. Yeah. <laughs> Bugs will give you Cactus Outlaw if you give him cigarettes in the schoolyard. Guru planes, let's be real. I'm not sure I understand. Freezy, freezy guy Jim. 
Is literally grass a real card? No, in Magic the Gathering, Guru lands are just expensive basics. Oh, okay. In Magic the Gathering, you have a resource system, and you have to acquire your resources by having uh, cards that are called land cards. And so one of the colors of mana, white mana, its land card is the plains. Uh, that's, that's its, that's what taps for white mana. So we're just making the joke that they have a monster bond card called literally grass, which is funny because in Match of the Gathering, we technically have that in the plains card. <laughs> so they literally have a base, <laughs> this is literally a basic plains, which is very funny. So cigarette, so we can give cigarettes the bugs. The Cubbies, okay. These card games are whack. <laughs> Honestly, I think Magic is one of the most reasonable ones because it has a theme of this is like crazy high fantasy stuff. But then other card games are just kind of weird to me. Like they're either based upon anime or they're like, or they're just like, weird alternates of Magic the Gathering, of people who are like, oh, fuck Magic, I'm gonna try a new game, and they make a new game, and it's not as popular as Magic. Yu-Gi-Oh! is actually insane to watch. Yeah, because their turns are all solitaire turns, and they kill each other on turn one or two. <laughs> it's... Like, the, the, fu the most interesting shit I ever saw about Yu-Gi-Oh! was watching a documentary on Mystic Mine... And I remember reading a comment about Mystic Mind where somebody was like, Mystic Mind is the monkey's paw of when someone wished to the wishing claw, I wish that Yu-Gi-Oh! matches lasted longer than two turns. <laughs> because Mystic Mind was a card that at its height in Yu-Gi-Oh! was literally forcing everyone to just deck themselves. <laughs> in order to beat the fucking card. So it's like Yu-Gi-Oh! became this insane one-turn kill card game, but then Mystic Minds turned it into like a 20-turn game of people decking themselves over that fucking card. <laughs> Therefore, it's the, it, it was a monkey paw of uh, somebody wanting Yu-Gi-Oh! to last longer. It's MTG if every deck was a combo deck. Yeah, basically. Like, it's Yu-Gi-Oh! is strange in the way it's curated because they don't really deck construct in the same way as you do in Magic the Gathering. Like, uh, because there's no, like, weird color stuff in Yu-Gi-Oh!, what happens is that uh, Konami... Or is it Capcom or is it Konami? I think it's Konami. Konami... What, what Konami does is that they print entire card sets that are all a singular synergistic archetype. And so when you make your deck in Yu-Gi-Oh, you're basically just playing a pre-made archetype and then adding a few things from outside of the archetype into it as like, you know, like meta, meta solutions or whatever the fuck, you know, just like sideboard stuff. I don't think they use a sideboard literally. Oh, wait, no, they, they use an extra deck. Never mind. So yeah, they do have a sideboard. The dev's Twitter account has nugget as the PFP. Uh, Nugget is definitely like the star of the series, yeah. Other than the other than the player. Okay, so I'm trying to figure out what I uh, how I get a lot of these. So this one I need to have enough money to get cigarettes. This one I need enough money to get the yo-yo. Yeah, yeah, their, their, their extra deck has a different purpose in that you actually pull shit from outside of the game, yes. Yeah. But yeah, like, Yu-Gi-Oh! is weird in that, like, uh, Konami prints, like, entire archetype sets. And then you have to play that set until they eventually decide that it's too strong or not. And then they ban the entire archetype that they printed. Meanwhile, in Magic, we have to 
take we, we basically have to just take cards from nowhere use our resource system to find synergies and then we make that's how we make a deck from scratch in magic which is very very different from Yu-Gi-Oh but the result is that every single time Yu-Gi-Oh has this one turn kill meta game it's because Konami literally printed an entire archetype designed to do that whereas in Magic the Gathering uh Wizards is w Wizards obviously wants to like push cards that are overpowered right but as a generality, they don't print entire archetypes of cards all at once that are meant to immediately be super powerful. Uh, like what they, what they what they do is that they just they just print cards, and if they happen to have synergy with other cards, then that's what players will do, right? And so, the reason it's so strange to me is that it means that basically. One turn kill in Yu-Gi-Oh is all the developers' fault. Like it's the, it's them literally printing every single archetype just to be a one turn kill deck. But in Magic the Gathering, they can make mistakes on individual cards, and those cards are way too powerful. But they don't literally curate the game to intentionally make Magic into a one turn kill like all combo deck game like they don't they don't actually do that they just print cards and sometimes those cards are fucking busted but they don't print entire archetypes and be like this archetypes thing is supposed to kill people on turn one it's like okay <laughs> and to be quite frank like magic player magic players are interesting because um we're very impatient because when you think about the way Yu-Gi-Oh plays out, you have to be very patient to tolerate Yu-Gi-Oh. Because every turn, you're just sitting there for 10 minutes watching your opponent take a solitaire turn where they're combo killing you on turn one. Like, so you have to have so much patience. Whereas in Magic the Gathering, whenever we get to a point where like eggs or lantern control is like dominant, Wizards literally just bans cards from, from those decks because magic players really fucking hate waiting for their opponent to do stuff. They want the they want the game to be my go, you go, my go, you go, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. And they, like they want the game to be like more at uh, 10 turns, you know, not I'm sitting here w w waiting 10 minutes for you to take your fucking solitaire turn, you know. So like magic players are very impatient. That's why mono red players with 60% win rate is less egregious than Azorius control with 53. Yeah, that's the thing. That's definitely the thing. Like, obviously, control and aggro are both very toxic strategies, but at least with aggro, you get to fucking play, you get to scoop the game up very quickly. Whereas with Azorius control, you're signing up for chess, but you didn't even bring the chessboard. You know, it's like your game plan is not I'm not trying to play an hour long game of chess with you with this motherfucker. Their entire thing is they're trying to force me to play chess with them for an hour when I'm not trying to do that. I'm wa I want to play the game for like half an hour, not an hour. <laughs> you know, unless it's commander, in which case a lot of people like commander games that are one to three hours. I want to turn my stuff sideways. <laughs> I'm gonna have this fistful of pennies. My en my lands are gonna enter tapped, and then my creature is gonna enter tapped, dealing damage to you immediately, and I pass the turn. Fucking ten second turn. <laughs> and then I'm gonna do it again. Until we until one of us dies. <laughs> So it's very funny that like uh like the uh people like talk about oh the There we go. People talk about magic like uh it's like a slower game than Yu-Gi-Oh, but I think the reality is that the way the games play out in the card games are just very different in that Yu-Gi-Oh is slow because the turns are long because they all they're all combo decks. In Magic, the game is quote-unquote slower because there's more turns, but the turns are all much shorter. 
Like in Magic the Gathering, it's not uncommon for you to play a, a land, no one drop, pass, and then your opponent just plays a land, no other cards, and then passes back to you. And it's like, that's like 10 seconds spent on two turns. Like, whereas in Yu-Gi-Oh, you're sitting there for 10 minutes watching prank kids fucking cycle through their entire deck and play a million cards and then attack you and then combo kill you. <laughs> like... So it's so like uh, it's just very different, and so like the way the you define speed in those card games is just so different. I don't know how I got on that tangent. Uh, so yeah, we need we need cigarettes, we need uh, the yo-yo. Martian Orb Man is hidden in Bug's secret stash. You can access it by stabbing Bugs and following him out to the hallway. Nugget will give you King Tower Beetle if you bring him a magnifying glass during morning time. So we need so that we have to do two different runs for that then because we can only go access one cubby. So let's give her a pill while playing house. It oh fuck a tornado if you find out what happened to her dog instead of getting something gross from the closet. Interesting. Really bright star if you dump the blood on Cindy instead of Lily at recess. Okay, those are mo all mutually exclusive. Cindy will give you doom jelly if you put gum in Lily's hair during lunch and get back before recess. Cyclops Duckling can be found by solving Jerome's riddle at recess. Okay, so there's a few of these I can do. Let's start with these two, and then I'll look at more as we go along. I went to cook pasta while you guys were talking about non-Kirby subjects. Oh, uh, one, one day, woman. I'm, you're, you're gonna listen to me talk about this shit. <laughs> You're gonna you're gonna fall asleep. <laughs> oh god. Okay. Uh, yeah. Let's, let's let's focus on these two first because they're pretty uh, easy. This is the schoolyard, not at recess. I made carbonara pasta with leftover chicken and veggies. That sounds delicious. Man, do I need any of these items? I don't think I need any of these for getting the monster mon cards. You have to rebrand all the lore using Kirby and Veggie Metaphor or I won't understand. <laughs> I'll just, uh, I'll just, I'll just like uh, make you a plant deck with uh, with Kiri as the commander. Then suddenly your brain will will expand and it'll be able it'll be able to comprehend. The only, the only problem, though, is that in Magic the Gathering, most creatures are not explicitly super cute. So like if I, so like a plant tribal deck, like all the plant creatures would kind of just look like actual plants or, or like plant monsters <laughs> instead of like veggies. And again, there's nothing stopping anyone from proxying cards and having their own nice cute art on them, you know, so. Wait, what? I have to, oh, okay, I have to, I can't actually start with money. Never mind, hold on. I have to go there with nothing. Whoa! 
Whoa, I've been robbing kids so I can buy these from Monty. Thanks a bunch. You could have this Monster Mon card. It's one of my favorites. Awesome. I'm still salty. I forgot to bring some basic forests and other shit to let Tarot try altering them. Oh, yeah, that would have been so cool. That would have been so fucking cool. <laughs> that would have been awesome. I'll do that, though. There's a... I, God, do I have plenty of basic lands to do that with. Uh, boxes and boxes of that shit. So, okay. Right. So we want the yo-yo. Get the yo-yo. Is there anything else I can do out here at the yard, though? Let's take a look. Inside the silly meal, Monty sells at lunch. Wall of Castle can be found in the trash can. Oh, yeah, we have that. Wait, what? I thought we... I thought we got this. Oh, whatever. Baptin Kalkin is in your silly meal with the special lunch. Okay. What, do you want me to paint the cards anyway? I don't know, whatever you want. Like, just a forest in your style, or an interpretation of the card in your style. Like, there's plenty of plants in Magic the Gathering. Like, you could always just like, paint a cute version of it if you wanted to. There's no, like, you know. Like, there's one, uh, like, I think the most famous plant people know about is Cultivator Colossus. And it's this gigantic-ass plant creature. It's not even vaguely cute. It's actually from a horror, it's actually from a horror set. <laughs> just a giant fucking plant monster. But what if it was just, like, veggies in a, in a trench coat, you know? The woman deck? I mean, there are alternate arts on on actual magic cards that are like designed to be like anime or like cute, but they're like they're, they're like expensive and all that, right? They're alternate arts, so they're super expensive and all that. And also recently, they just did a a set of all animals, like all cute animals, like the most. That's like the most recent set. It's all cute animals, right? So a lot of that, like, uh, it's like watershed down, at like a uh, intelligent animal stuff. And that's very cute. But they aren't plants. Bloomborough's upper alley, yeah. I agree. 100%. Gander will give you evil thwarter if you get Sydney to eat one of his biscuit balls. Water ship down? Yeah, I guess so. Look, I remember that there's like three of these really famous like intelligent animal story books or whatever and i never know which one is which okay <laughs> there's like water there's like water ship down there's like red wall and then there's like something else and i never fucking remember what the fucking name is of any of them ever eye of the butt holder is in the middle box in the bathroom <laughs> what the fuck Nugget's lunch table. Okay, we can't do anything else here, so, uh... Only OGs know Wind in the Willows. Why does that sound familiar?
Yeah, I don't give a shit. I got a Monster Bond card. So. That's two cards down. Man, Monty has a mission has a thing where we can where we can buy something for fifteen dollars. Um Yeah, we can't do this, we have to do this on a different day. You give him either a flask or breathalyzer at recess. Gregor the Overlander was a fun young adult novel. Oh. Give her a pill while playing house. Jesus. Instead of getting something gross. Okay, so what I'm getting out of these interactions is that I should try to do the thing where I become Cindy's boyfriend. That's what I'm getting out of this. So we actually have to... I could just skip through the whole day, though, right? Actually, yeah, can't I just skip through the entire day to get the... I think I could just skip the whole day to get the cards. Oh, riddle. Riddle, riddle, riddle. Okay. Figure what out? This riddle about these stupid duck things. Apparently if you shake them in the right order, something is supposed to happen. What's the riddle? Go twice the duck that's furthest south. Then two blue before red. After, return to the first duck, then blue. Get it wrong and you're dead. So, yellow, yellow, blue, blue, red, yellow, blue. Yellow, yellow, blue, blue, red, yellow, blue. Yep. Cool. I think that's it. In Wind of the Willows, Toad crashes a car and goes to prison for 20 years while hippies squat in his house. And twit the, and twit their tipples, yeah. Okay. Actually happens. Well, he doesn't stay in prison. He sneaks out disguised as a woman. <laughs> okay, we got like four cards in one in one try, so that's pretty good. Oh, I, oh, I already had literally grass. Whoops. <laughs> that's fine. Cactus Outlaw. No one knows which is more shocking, the crimes he's committed or that he's a sentient cactus. Outlaws of Thunder Junction be like. This is the Freezy Guy Jim card. He's probably the coolest guy named Jim you'll ever meet. I hate you, Bristly Bill. Bill spined the, the cactus guy. Bill spied the cactus guy. Bill, 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 Bill. Lands rule. <laughs> Nobody's gonna fucking understand that. That's like, that's like just a shit post that was produced in my head and then I blurted it out to my fucking friends. <laughs> I know you guys are making card jokes, but it reminds me of Cactus Gunman. Yeah, like all the all three of those things coincide. I should show you Bristly Bill, and then you can make a 
You can draw a picture of him meeting Cactus Gunman, I guess. <laughs> I will make juice of him. It's really funny. My brother, my brother is a mono green player. You know, a, a degenerate. And so, uh, I mean, I love green too, but I also hate green. I love it, but I hate it. Um, and like, he decided to make another mono green commander deck and he made Bristly Bill. And it's like, I guess it's technically a step down from fucking Omnath Locus of Mana, but fuck you anyway, still. <laughs> That's like one of the most pushed two mana legendary cards they've ever printed in a, you know, standard match at the Gathering, you know? It's so fucked. But oh no, it's a step down from my other deck. It's like, okay, sure, sure. But hey, because he plays it, I get to make the Bill Spine, the Cactus Guy joke, so. This is Cyclops Duckling. It's not a species or anything. It's just a duckling that had its left eye pecked out by a bigger duckling. That's depressing as fuck. Okay. This Bill looks homosexual. <laughs> Gregory is gonna hate all these new guests this <laughs> so Martian Orbit hidden in Bugs' secret stash. You can access it. He looks like a pillar man wearing green cowboy fringe. Does he? Oh, uh don't I don't know if you literally searched for Bill Spine, but you sh uh, no, like, literally bristly Bill. His original art, he just looks like this weird cactus creature. Oh, Rag sent a picture? I never thought his art really looked like he was wearing cowboy fringe. He just looks like this cactus creature to me, really. Like a weird thing. Nugget will give you t King Tower Beetle if you bring him a magnifying glass. You give him either a flask or breathalyzer. The cactus needles look like cowboy fringe. Oh, okay, all right. You give her a pill while playing house. So I have to add. So this. So to get her, get her a pill, I have to get the pill from Nugget, and I have to be her boyfriend. And then I can give the breathalyzer to Bugs. So I don't particularly need... And I can get the magnifying glass... Okay, I think I know what I can do. Okay. Let's get the yo-yo. Yo, yo. Okay. Let's talk to Nugget and get a pill. What's in those pills? Okay. Now I need to do be Cindy's boyfriend. Okay, during morning time.
how the fuck did I mute myself? I don't even remember. I don't care, Jerome. We do that. Now we do this. There we go, breathalyzer. What the fuck? There's that temper my mother warned me about. She was so right about you. Take your stupid flask back. You obviously care more about it than you do about me or your unborn child. Unborn child? I well, while you're in prison, it's probably not yours. You cheated on me? It was only one time. I was alone. He was there for me when you weren't. I, I didn't know how to get by. Please don't get mad. We can get through this. I still love you. I want a divorce. Hi, you're right. This isn't working out. What do we do now? <laughs> Spend the night with your mother. Do I just sell my apple? I guess so. Was there something? Is there something I can do here at lunch? How do you just stab bugs, I wonder? Wait, can we do the breathalyzer and also give her a pill? Did we ha we have a pill too? Oh god damn it. It's okay. We find out what happened to her dog instead of getting something gross. We could do that. Or we can pour the blood on her. Ooh. Okay, let's keep doing Cindy, Cindy stuff. Something to eat. Oh fuck, I forgot. Oh, it's <laughs> Isn't there a card stuck in an event? Yes, we already have it. Hey, hold on. <laughs> Fucking Christ. Okay. Let's get the slop. Yep, give me the slop. Yep. Okay, we're now we're going to make her eat her dog. I'm sure your friend little friend Cindy would love to try one, yep.
That's the bathroom. We're gonna dump the blood on her. I'm gonna dump it on Cindy. going on Cindy come back don't go running into the street or you'll get hit by a I keep telling the principal we need to put a fence there sheesh okay children there's been an accident that I don't want to get blamed for we're going to cut recess a little short today everyone head inside oh no wait no 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 holy shit I almost forgot do this you don't look busy I am Ah, oh, what's the point? It's no fun being a bully when no matter how many kids you beat up, my dad still isn't coming back. A little bit sentimental there. I miss everything about him, even though he used to drink excessively. Here. A breathalyzer? Ah, oh, it's just like the one my mom used to force my dad to use. Thanks, buddy. No problem. Here's a Monster Bond card. I really appreciate having, th having this. I'll see you later. No problem. Can I, like... Oh, I can't sell any of this. Okay. Twitch's recent mobile update makes it feel like TikTok. Oh, that sucks. That's disgusting. Yeah, so I uh, I like this. How we uh, we um, you know we we make uh, Cindy fucking kill herself. I enjoy that. only that was a part of the canon ending. I just saw her shoe. That's funny. Okay, that's four cards. Oh. Okay, thank you so much for doing that. You're thanking me for killing Cindy? Oh, yes, indeedy I am. Do you know how long I wanted that little snot dead? I tried poisoning her once, but apparently poison isn't vegan enough for her. He doesn't even know what vegan means. I know, that girl could only be dumber if her parents were siblings, if you know what I mean. Haha. <laughs> yeah. I want you to have this gold star for doing the world, of, the world a favor. Just don't tell anyone how you got it. Also, a special treat since there was a blood involved and I got to watch. Here's a Monster Mon card. That's messed up, but thank you. You're welcome. Let's head back inside for show and tell. <laughs> oh, you just love being my little rat, don't you? Showing off your gold star to the rest of these imbeciles. That's very good. Thank you for sharing. It's going to be hard to beat that. All right. I got a bunch of cards out of that, so... And Cindy is fucking dead. <laughs> rat, 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 rat. Rats, rats, we are the rats. Okay. This is the really bright star card. It actually burned out decades ago. It's just really far away. <laughs> Physics joke. This is the King Tower Beetle card. He's just a regular beetle that lives in the King's Tower. Okay. This is the shroom turtle card. It's a guy who ate some shrooms and now thinks he's a turtle. This is Ogglebop Golem card. No one knows what Ogglebop really is, but everyone is too afraid to ask him. <laughs> okay. So. There's quite a few we had. This is like the weirdest one. I don't know how to do this one. Access it by stabbing him and following him out to the hallway. I don't know how to make that happen. I need to get the pill again to give to Cindy. Yeah, there's like two more cards that Cindy will give me.
This one requires I not be her boyfriend, though, because I have to I have to not be her boyfriend, then talk to her during lunch. Oh, this is in the bathroom. Okay, that's that's easy. What the fuck? <laughs> this is some of this is just really I forgot about this fucking thing too. God damn it. Uh Could have gotten five cards right there, but I'm stupid. I also need to do the principal's office again. And I need to... Show it at show and tell, or eat it at lunch as Cindy's boyfriend. Oh my god, there's so many things I could have done. Fuck. Okay, uh... Whoops. So we need to be seat her boyfriend at least one more time. Yeah, okay, let's just, um... Let's get money and do the boyfriend shit. Again. But I also need a pill from Nugget. That might be fine, though. Yeah, 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 you... yes. So, uh, right. We have to do this to get the pill. Okay. Now we do the Cindy stuff. Do I have any other reason to... Yeah, I want to get the pass from Jerome, maybe? Ah, that's probably... There's probably not enough actions to do that. I don't know. I can always restart the room. Then I'll sell the other apple, I guess. So, let's see. Can we do Jerome's thing and her thing? I don't know. Okay. Why do I have to make dinner? Because I've been so busy maintaining the house and I... Have you been drinking again? No, honey, I'm just tired. Is that a breathalyzer? can work through this. You think so? You know, you filthy whore. Put it up for adoption. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. But I know there's a lot of paperwork. It'll give me a headache. You would happen to have something to take the edge off. I have a pill you can take. Perfect. <laughs> wow, who knew giving up a child giving giving up a child would feel so nice. You're the best boyfriend ever. I think you earned a special treat. Cool. Monster Mon card. Okay, we have three things left. I think we can do Jerome's thing. Here's my pass. No! Ah, oh, fuck. 
Damn it. Okay, I can't do both of them, but oh well. Shite. Um, is there any way I could sell these things to... Actually, yeah, that might be... That's not going to be $15, though, so I don't really think that's going to matter. Yeah, I know. It's been hella overtime because I got distracted. Wait, wait, wait. I saw like an apple thing or whatever. Did she eat it? Yes. Just one of like those cards. Skedaddle. Yep. Be skedaddling. Wait a minute. I uh, probably need to buy the screwdriver. Hmm. I'm not sure. Card. Oh, wait, that's Sneaky Snake. I'm stupid. Take the note. I have to leave now or the janitor will kill me. Does the note reveal... This paper... A stupid note? We can't even read. You better find someone who can read this who won't get us into trouble. It better be worth it. Oh, I'll find someone. And don't dare show it to the teacher. We'll get in trouble if you do that. Yep. Can you read this? Psh, of course I can read. I'm not some Neanderthal-like bugs. I can read anything for a buck deal. Recipe of some sort. Oh, this is the Janda's recipe for those gross-looking biscuit ball things. He... Oh, God. What? He... He's using biscuit! He's actually using Cindy's missing dog as an ingredient! Oh, that is just so messed up! Hope he is. I hope no one has ever eaten one. That'd be gross! Uh, yeah, it would. Recipe for janitor's biscuit balls. It's just a stupid recipe! I can't believe I went to all the trouble of stealing the key! For the janitor's closet, just so you can steal a dumb recipe! Your dog is an ingredient. What?! That creepy old man is so dead! Where is he? I'm gonna kill him! Janitor! What's going on there, little girl? How could Janitor help you? You killed my dog! What breed was it? The meat was quite tasty. I'm going to kill you with my bare hands! Come here! Wow, you're faster than I... Ow! Ow! Hey, stop! Okay, I get I'll put the pieces of your dog back. My mop! I need that! My ear! You bit off my ear! That's not all I'm about to bite off! Ah! What the fuck? I wasn't expecting to find out what happened to my dog today. I'm sorry for dragging you into this, but you have exceeded my expectations as a boyfriend. That was pretty messed up. Did she bite off his penis? No, she bit off his head. I know, but I'll make it up to you. Here, you can have this flower. It's pretty to me. It's pretty like me. Uh, thanks. I can tell by that look in your eye you deserve a little more. It's a special Monster Mon card. Very good. Just know you'll have something good to show now. I don't think there's anything else I can really do here. Is 
Uh, yeah, just show a card. She's still carrying his head even right now. How dare you? What did I do? Really? You have the gall to stand there as if you have no idea what you did wrong back there? I honestly have no idea. The flower! My special flower! The one I gave you for being my best boyfriend I ever had! What about it? You didn't show it during show and tell! If it means that little to you, then I'm just gonna take it back. We're through. Goodbye. Bye. I don't care. I was here for the cards. Oh, fuck a tornado. <laughs> okay. This has been way too much overtime because I got distracted. This is the Ofaka Tornado card. It's been said that people get sucked into it or are compelled to say its name. Okay. I mean, if I was getting sucked into a tornado, I'd be like, oh, fuck. You know, that'd be pretty normal. This is the Giraffe Serpent card. It's a snake with a really long ne neck or body. We can't tell. <laughs> evil Thwarter card. It doesn't thwart evil. It is a thwarter that is evil. <laughs> I was here for the cards, like a true nerd. <laughs> yeah. I don't care, Cindy. I already, I already did the timeline. Okay. I think I'm going way too long overtime. So... I have to specifically do a day where I do the special lunch. What if I literally... Maybe this could be really fast, actually. Hold on a moment. Let's just get the, the lunch pass. Can I just, like, speed, speed through the days? Like... and just get one card a day, like, who cares, right? Oh! I just, I just stood there, got the card, okay. Faster. Biggle Tits probably ate that meal if you didn't. She's so fat. Yeah. She's very lucky that her body weight is distributed evenly between her tits and the rest of her body. This is the Fapton Kalkin card. He'll show you his moves, but you probably don't want to see them. <laughs> God. What the fuck? Middle box in the bathroom. Show him Jerome's hall pass in the bathroom if you threaten to tell about the bags and say it's not about the laser. Okay, let's do that. I don't need uh, a lot to do that. I just need Jerome. I just need this. That's it. Okay. This is actually very easy the more I think about it, just skipping everything. Three hour stream? Probably not three hours. It's probably not necessary.
Oh, I have to restart the room. Okay. Whoops. I have to threaten to tell... I have to... There's blood coming out of me for a moment there. Right, for do gotta look at this. Gotta look at this. Okay, and then gotta look at this. How did that judgment get passed down? Okay. If me see a bloody bank. Nickel won't cut it. Give me more I'm telling about the bloody bank. I'll take the nickel. Fuck! Nope, that's not... How do I... How do I threaten him with the hall pass? How do I do that exact thing? Like... You show him Jerome's the judgment got passed down by judgment point. <laughs> Janet will give you mental long. You show him Jerome's hall pass in the bathroom if you threaten to tell about the bags and say it's not about the laser. I have to show him Jerome's hall pass and threat and threaten to tell about the bags. Okay. I think I'm gonna do the e the easier one, maybe. No! Fuck! How does this work? <laughs> I don't understand. We'll get the easier one because I'm I'm just going to I'm just getting annoyed. There we go. Uh... I don't care, might as well. Uh, I think maybe we just power through the day now. We just got the eye of the butthole. I don't know how to get this one. Principal will give you spiky flimflam if you tell him you were fighting with Billy over monster mon cards. What? Lunch lady will give you uneaten cake if she thinks you went through three helpings of slop.
Okay, let's go to the principal's office. Inside the silly meal Monty sells at lunch. Can I even buy that? Two fifty. I think if I show that meal at recess, I can uh, or uh, show and tell or whatever. Right. Three helpings of slop. How do I eat it? Oh. Once you've eaten what you already have. Aha! Okay. Oh, the... It's all gone already. Oh, shit. Well, that sucks. Uh, I don't think there's anything I can do out here, so just end the day. There we go. Some of these cards I'm really not sure how to get, so this is not where I think we're just going to end it now. Because some of them are, like, very confusing. Like, I don't really... I'm confused as to how we're not getting them. Like, the one where we talk to the janitor. This is the magical airship card. No one knows where it takes its passengers because none of them have ever returned. Stop reading. This is the Eye of the Butt Holder card. The art for this card is just a zoomed in the picture of the black back of a cat. Oh, God. Jesus Christ. Okay. But that's... That's the, oh. Goodness gracious. Okay. That should, uh, we should just be done for today. Thank you all very much for joining me here tonight. I really appreciate you coming here to hang out with me. We will be back in four days. Uh, Wednesday, if you live in the United States. Um, if I'm going to be honest, I think we're just going to play this game first and then we'll just go into the chill stream game because like th like there's just so little of this game left that it's like it it'd be weird to just push it all the way back until next friday like th i could see this being a 30 minute the rest of this game being a 30 minute thing on wednesday and then we just go to the chill stream um and then next Friday and Saturday, I wasn't expecting us to beat this game so quickly. I guess maybe we could just start the second one because it's just, you know, I'm, I'm shrugging right now. Like, it's just, I don't really know. I didn't, I wasn't expecting us to beat this so quickly, um, but we did. Uh, so I guess next week we'll just do the next game and that should be much longer. That should hopefully be twice as long because it's, it's objectively a bigger game. Um... And yeah, I, I, oh, I went hella overtime. Uh, if you happen to be new here and you enjoyed hanging out with us tonight, if you think I deserve a follow, I'd appreciate that quite a bit. We stream three times a week for approximately two hours. And this stream will be re-uploaded to YouTube tomorrow night where we're joining every single stream I've ever done. So if there are any you want to catch up on, you can find all of them there. Link is in the About section. And yeah, it's way overtime. So thank you all very much for being here. I appreciate your support in every capacity. We're real close to 100 <laughs> to 100 followers. That's pretty crazy. One day you will do a 10 hour stream. Uh, yeah, hopefully uh, my living situation by then will be a lot different so that that is possible. So, yes, that'd be cool. I wouldn't mind trying a 10 hour stream at some point. Uh, but yeah. Hope you all have a uh, good afternoon evening, morning, etc. And I will see you all again soon with more kindergarten and some chilling. Ciao!